Live from the world's capital markets, here are the latest financial headlines brought to you by BYOB Trading Academy. Hello and welcome to Friday's Daily Financial Report. Oil prices slid by about $2 a barrel to their lowest level since late March, dragged lower by fears a possible recession could dent fuel demand and after a rise in US gasoline inventories. JP Morgan, Citigroup, Wells Fargo and Bank of America wrote off $3.4 billion in bad loans from borrowers in the first three months of 2023. The banks are putting aside increased amounts in reserves to cover the risk of more borrowers failing to repay their debt. The US Securities and Exchange Commission is advising brokers and investment advisors they need to use heightened scrutiny when it comes to making crypto recommendations to ensure the risky products are in the best interests of their clients. The agency said in a new bulletin, the euro-dollar pair made a minor upwards correction in the last session, gaining 0.1%. The ultimate oscillator is giving a positive signal. The Bitcoin dollar pair dove 2% in the last session. The stochastic RSI indicates an oversold market. The pound dollar price remained largely unchanged in the last session. The ROC is giving a positive signal. The Aussie gained 0.5% against the dollar in the last session. The ROC's positive signal is in line with the overall technical analysis. The US Baker Hughes US oil rig count will be released at 1700 hours GMT. Japan's Jibun Bank Manufacturing PMI at 0 hundred hours and 30 minutes GMT. Japan's Jibun Bank Services PMI at 0 hundred hours and 30 minutes GMT. Japan's CFTC JPY NC net positions will be released at 2030 GMT. The UK's retail sales at 0600 hours GMT. The UK's CFTC GBP NC net positions at 2030 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Friday's Market Outlook. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day.